is cholesterol? Cholesterol is a sticky, fat-like substance that is both your friend and your enemy. The human body needs cholesterol to function, and at normal levels, it plays a vital role in how every cell works. But when cholesterol levels become too high, it becomes dangerous and increases your risk of heart disease. The cholesterol circulating in your blood comes from two sources. Around 75% is produced naturally by the liver. The other 25% comes from food. There are two main types of cholesterol. LDL Hello. and HDL. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> LDL carries cholesterol from your liver to the cells that need it. When there is too much of this cholesterol in the blood, it can start to build up in the arteries and restrict the flow of blood to the heart. It is no wonder that this type of cholesterol is often referred to as bad cholesterol. HDL helps to carry this extra cholesterol away from the bloodstream and back to the liver where it can be broken down and passed from the body. This type of cholesterol is known as good cholesterol, and the more HDL you have, the lower your risk of developing heart disease. Ooh. Ooh, thank you. What's this? It is important to keep your cholesterol levels within healthy limits. You should aim to keep your total cholesterol level below 5 millimoles per litre, your LDL level below 3 millimoles per litre, and your HDL level higher than 1 millimole per litre. What are the causes of high cholesterol? There are a number of factors that can cause you to have high cholesterol. Some of these factors are fixed, meaning that they are out of your control while others are the result of unhealthy lifestyle choices and are completely preventable. You might want to pop that down for this Ooh. next bit. One of the main preventable causes of high cholesterol is an unhealthy diet. Eating foods that contain a lot of saturated fat can raise the level of cholesterol in the blood. Saturated fat is found in dairy products such as butter, full fat milk and hard cheese. Processed foods such as cakes and biscuits and fatty cuts of meat such as bacon, salami and sausages. Other lifestyle related factors that can lead to high cholesterol also include being overweight, a lack of physical exercise, drinking too much alcohol and smoking. I'll take that thank you. However, some people have high cholesterol despite living clean, eating healthily and getting plenty of exercise. Some of the fixed factors that can lead to high cholesterol levels include age, Hello. gender Hello. and family history. What can I do to lower my cholesterol? Remember all those foods containing saturated fat? You should replace these with reduced fat spreads, skimmed or semi-skimmed milk, dried fruits and cereals, extra light soft cheese, lean cuts of meat such as skinless chicken, fish and lean mince. Another easy way to improve your diet is to look out for cholesterol lowering foods such as those containing plant sterols. A daily intake of between 1.5 and 2.4 grams of plant sterols has been scientifically proven to actively lower cholesterol levels. If eating plant sterols are really not your thing, never mind. There are a number of supplements designed to help lower your cholesterol, like Forza Cholesterol. This natural supplement gives you all the daily plant sterols you need to start lowering your cholesterol and reducing your risk of developing heart disease. Getting regular exercise is also important to help lower cholesterol, whether you're overweight or not. For best results, you should try jogging, cycling, swimming, or taking an aerobics class. Okay, let's go. Other lifestyle changes that can make a big difference to all aspects of heart health include reducing your alcohol consumption and giving up smoking. According to NHS statistics, people who quit smoking before the age of 60 can add three years to their life, while those who give up before 30 can prolong their life by an extra 10 years. 
Although not all factors contributing to high cholesterol can be controlled, there are many that can. You should try to do everything in your power to maintain a healthy cholesterol level, as this could pave the way to a brighter, healthier, and more active future.